what is up everybody gonna be another video today today we're gonna be replacing window regulators on this 96 ek um some fresh ones in the boxes right here probably gonna start on the passenger side first and then uh i'll just record throughout it it's gonna be fun both of them have chipped chipped um holder pieces or uh handle pieces so we're gonna be replacing them due to that but let's do this all right just setting up the scene real quick looks like we're gonna be taking out with a screwdriver um most of this is gonna be handle handle um you remove the speaker casing and it's gonna be three behind here uh, we'll go ahead and get started real quick just to go ahead and start flowing with it Oh, oh, these handles, they have like a little weird way they come off. Now for the speaker cover, it just pops right out. So just pull towards yourself and then it'll pop there. Then we're going to remove those three screws. Okay. Boom. Another one down there below. Specifically in this one. And another one right here in this one. We need one of those headlight things. Wave it. Alright. Yeah. Then it should just pop off. You do have two pins right here. You want to just slightly pull. You don't want to go crazy with it. And usually you'll have this top strip. It'll be pushed into this groove right here. So after you, you pull it toward you to pop them out, you kind of have to like jolt it up to get it to break free from that one. Boom. Also, I have to be careful too as well because the speaker is still going to be attached. All right, this is the part where it gets a little bit uh, tricky. So you're going to grab some vice grips. Then you know, get it gripped on. Roll your window down to a point. This is going to be the look point. You're going to line it up. This is what holds in the window. That screw right there. Another screw is going to be right here and behind this item. So it's a little bit meticulous, but as Joe said, we were going to get done. So after removing those bolts, you want to hold that window, be ready to hold that window because you're going to have to angle it and angle it going towards the outside and pull it up and go through. And once you have that, you can go ahead and start taking off your actual regulator. So. pieces over time and they get chewed up. And a lot of the times the windows start slipping out of the track. Also, not rolling up correctly. So now we have that new greased up, ready to go. All right, so once you get that line back up and bolt your stuff down, you're gonna have to go ahead and get your uh, window, pull the line back up. These two as well. This one. Yeah, and these, two, these last two are uh, in a batch of these four. So make sure you knock off um, all six. And then, like I said, get the pillar ready to get the window back in here. All right, after going through this, I would definitely grab the handle that you're about to be using. And I would take the window all the way down. I'm talking about when you're putting it back in, you want to make sure your window pillar 
nuts or our bolts are lined up with this giant hole. So drop it down, make sure it's on the track correctly. There's gonna be two, one right here, and then one on the outer side. Just gotta line that up. This is the back side door. And then you can line up the front side of the door. Once that's in, screw those into the the lesser side of the um, lesser hole size. And boom. And then go ahead and give yourself a test. Make sure that thing's rolling up like it's supposed to. All right, before putting the door cart back on, make sure you plug in your speaker. All right, it's up there. Let's get some cleaning done, but it runs pretty good. And then you just want to repeat on the other side, and then pretty much done. Um, looks a lot more better now. Working windows looks great. So, um, thanks for watching, and uh, stay tuned for another one.